I was eight, I was taken away from my mother when she was arrested for drugs. By the time I was 12, I was in my 10th foster home. Where was God when I was suffering all these years? You think you know me? You don't know anything! Well, you may know her best from Disney's ever popular high school musical movies, but Vanessa Hudgens' new movie really shows her in a different way. The movie is called Gimme Shelter. It opens later this month. She plays the daughter of an addict who winds up on the street. A really gritty role for Vanessa Hudgens, who uh, is bearing the cold this morning <laughs> and uh, is in studio with us. Nice to have you here. Thank you. I survived. How much are you regretting that you agreed to come to Chicago no, in actually, January? No, actually, it's an amazing thing. The fact that this is happening right now and I get to be a part of it, <laughs> it's pretty cool. Sa San Diego girl, right? Yeah, I grew up in San Diego, so but you, you just really California. You never grew up in any kind of no, cold weather? No, I am weather. not meant for this. <laughs> my blood doesn't know how to handle it. Yeah, I think that's the case for most of us, but you were telling me that you were actually in Alaska when it was colder than this at one yeah. time. Yeah, I mean, with winter, it was negative 30. Um, but there's no way of preparing yourself for it. It's just shocking. Taking deep breaths hurt. Yeah. It's not right. <laughs> yeah, you are 100% you are correct yeah, about it's that. Yeah, horrible. <laughs> so uh, this movie uh, is such a departure for you. I, I guess because we think of High School Musical still with, uh -huh. you know, with you, but you've done so many other things since then. Yeah. But this was really gritty and really... A little bit on the dark side. Yeah. Uh, what was it like for you to do this? It was challenging and so exciting. I mean, I, I feel like it's an actor's dream to really have a true <coughs> metamorphosis and transform into a completely different person from yourself. And I really got to sink in my teeth on this one and had an amazing cast, James Earl Jones, Rosario Dawson, Brendan Fraser. So every day was, was a journey, but it was, it was fun. Yeah, do you, do you feel like you, you have to make uh, certain kinds of movies? to break away, you know, to de-Disney-fy yourself? I mean, I, I just love having variety and, and growth and, and stepping into the things that kind of scare me because that's how you grow, you know? So when I read this project, the character just really resonated with me and the story, it's based on a true story. So uh, I don't know, I just was very certain that I had to do this and know that I could have my own take on it and be something completely different from what anyone's seen and completely di different from anything I've seen myself do too. Yeah. So just proving it to myself is a neat thing. Yeah, you can you probably understand, you know, the, the Miley Cyruses and, uh, you know, some of the rest who came up in the Disney factory, <laughs> uh, you know, really trying to set themselves apart in some way, I guess. I think it's just growth, you know? I mean, we all were a part of Disney when we were young and we're growing up and we're just kind of seeing what we like and what we gravitate towards, you know? I've always followed my gut and um, I think that's what everyone's trying to do, too. Look at all you young kids there. I know. <laughs> Not that... when we did when I was, I was 16 years old, 25, nine years ago. How about that? Yeah. Isn't that amazing? You actually look the same, Vanessa. I know. I don't age, which is amazing. That's, yeah, it's, you've got those good genes. Uh, yeah. was, that, was this a fun time for you? Uh, high School Musical? Yeah. Yeah, of course. I was a kid running around singing and dancing with some of my closest friends. How could it not be? Yeah. Do you keep in touch with your High School Musical pals? Yeah, of course. I mean, one of them's getting married, which is very exciting. Um, they're just amazing. We, we shared such a crazy whirlwind of a journey together. So looking back at that, we'll, yeah. we'll always be buds. The, everyone is really going to see you in such a different way when Gimme Shelter opens. And I, I just wonder, as a young actress, I mean, are there actresses that you look up to, that you emulate, you know, that you want to be like as you progress in your career? Yeah, I think it's all about longevity. And uh, I think Meryl Streep's nailed that the best. She's had such amazing projects and reinvented herself role after role after role. And she is such a such an amazing work form. And she, I just admire her. She's just amazing. So, of course her, but at the same time, you also want to make your own destiny and your own path and have your own mark. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we can get a, a tight shot. Can you just show your nails here real, <laughs> real quick? I, I don't know if we're able to see this. Look at those amazing, that's the most amazing <laughs> sculpturing I've ever seen in my no, life. No, it's fun. Give I got me, Jesus. Everything. <laughs> I got 2014. You got a little of everything, got everything. Out there. <laughs> uh, Give Me Shelter opens on January the 25th. Stay warm out there Thanks. is our advice to everybody. Yeah. Vanessa Hutchins, nice to have you with Thank us. Thank you. Guys, back to you. All right, stick around for our 9 o'clock hour. We've got more coverage of the impact of the severe cold snap here in the Chicago area. And the time on our tradition.